Leicester hosted Newcastle on Saturday with the hosts looking to bounce back from a defeat to Bath, which put a dent in their top four hopes. Tigers still held fourth place at the beginning of the day, though, and took the lead in the East Midland sunshine as Freddie Burns slotted an early penalty. Newcastle, still very much in the hunt for a Champions Cup place, responded with a penalty of their own through last weekend's match winner Joel Hodgson. In a scrappy remainder of the half, another Burns penalty looked to have the host 6-3 ahead at the break. That lead was to be extended, however. Ellis Gens burrowing over, and with the help of the TMO, referee Ian Tempest awarded the game's first try. Tigers came out firing from the off in the second half, and after Davy Wilson was sent to the Simbin, Leicester took advantage of their extra man and went over in the corner through Toulouse of Ayanu. Tom Youngs was brought on to help shore up the host line-out, but it was his handling in the loose which helped set up Leicester's third. Genge crashing over for his second. A heated exchange was to follow after Genge had thrown the ball at a Newcastle head. Luckily for him, only at the cost of a penalty restart. A Burns conversion took them 25-3 ahead, and after nearly 15 minutes of frustration, as they went in search of a bonus point, it was Burns' half-back partner Ben Youngs to make the all-important breakthrough. After a quick tap penalty, the England scrum half showed a great turn of speed to dart in for the five-point score. A massive win in the context of the top four race, with Newcastle's search for a spot in Europe's premier tournament dealt a huge blow. The final score from Welford Road, Leicester 30, Newcastle 3.